Hey guys, it's Brooke. I've been playing this uh, Epiphone Emperor II Joe Pass model guitar quite a bit. And uh, I gotta say, it's got very low action, very straight neck, good sounding pickups. It's been a lot of fun to play. Nice looking guitar. So it's supposed I'm supposed to be selling it, but <laughs> having a little problem. So this reminds me of uh, a book I worked out of uh, quite a while ago from the Progressive series. The title, I believe, was Jazz Guitar. And there was something I learned from that book that I used to practice quite a bit. It was something like... Uh, it's a major to a major 7 to a, a 6th back to a major 7. Let's turn on the amp. Wait a minute. Amp is on. All right. Keeping it real. All right. So it's some kind of irritating shapes that took me a long time to learn. What what I'm doing here is a G, G flat, E, and the G flat. Those notes are changing, but the the root third and the fifth of the chord do not change. So uh, the first chord's a major, major G. It's a G, G major. Root, root, third, fifth. Weird shape, index, pinky, ring, middle. Very bizarre. Index, middle, ring, pinky. G, D, B, G. Okay, the, um, the G major, so we're gonna, now that's our G major. We're going to flat this G here down to a G flat. So I have to, I'm going to keep these two fingers in place for, this is a G major 7th. These two fingers stay, and these two switch. Switch strings, and you end up one fret lower. So that's a G. G flat, B, and D. Index, ring, pinky, middle. That took me a while to understand. Okay, now we're gonna flat this G flat down to E, which is a sixth degree of a G major scale. So now I have to rebuild my shape. It's a real pain. <laughs> That's index on the second fret fourth string the e the sixth interval middle's on the root g pinky's on the b on the third string fourth fret ring is on second string third fret d let's let me go through them slow here's major major seventh sixth back to the major seventh almost a cliche. It's a very common little chord figure. Ah. F. But you know, if I just play the same old stuff I always play, that's okay, but it's better to ch try some new stuff. Try to get more variety in your playing. Cool. So I'm just doing a circle of fourths here. So I, to, guitar teachers always say, if you really want to learn it, learn it in all keys. free time here just to keep it kind of loose so what do you think of that shape you know you might start with middle ring pinky then bring in your index take you some time if you're interested in learning this 
Uh, I could probably put a PDF together if you would like that. Um, so this is something I would practice after the sun goes down, after the students go away. I'll sit on the couch and play something like that till I fall asleep. After I played some uh, Paganini and some uh, Alex Skolnick last night and uh, this. So if you're interested or have any questions, let me know. I'll help you out any way I can. Thank you so much for checking out my channel. If you can subscribe, that really helps. Take care.